The aftermath of World War I left Germany in a state of profound transformation and upheaval. The Treaty of Versailles, economic hardship, political instability, and societal disintegration converged to create a tumultuous period in German history. In this article, we will delve into the turbulent years that followed the Great War and the challenges Germany faced in rebuilding itself. Part I, the burden of the Treaty of Versailles, harsh terms and national humiliation. The Treaty of Versailles, signed in 1919, imposed severe penalties on Germany. It demanded territorial concessions, military limitations, and substantial reparations payments. The treaty's terms were perceived as a national humiliation, economic crisis and hyperinflation. The weight of war debt, combined with reparations payments, led to hyperinflation. The German mark became nearly worthless, causing widespread economic hardship and social instability. Part 2 Weimar Republic and Political Unrest the fragile foundations of democracy. The establishment of the Weimar Republic marked Germany's transition to a democratic system. However, political factions were deeply divided, and the Republic faced challenges from both the left and right. The Spartacist uprising and cap punch. Political extremism led to violent uprisings. The Spartacist uprising in 1919 and the cap punch in 1920 threatened the stability of the fledgling Republic. Part 3 The Golden Twenties and Cultural Flourishing. The Roaring Twenties Despite economic difficulties, the mid-1920s witnessed a period of cultural and artistic flourishing known as the Golden Twenties. Berlin became a vibrant center of intellectual and artistic creativity, expressionism, Bauhaus, and new objectivity. Art movements like Expressionism, the Bauhaus School, and New Objectivity reflected the dynamic spirit of the age. Innovations in art, architecture, and literature define this period. Part IV Economic Recovery and Political Instability the Dawes Plan and Economic Stabilization The Dawes Plan of 1924 provided a framework for economic recovery. Foreign loans and investment helped stabilize the German economy, leading to a brief period of relative prosperity. The Great Depression and Political Polarization The global economic downturn of the late 1920s and early 1930s hit Germany hard. Unemployment soared, leading to widespread social unrest and a surge in support for extremist political parties. Part V, the rise of extremism and the fall of democracy. The emergence of the Nazi Party. Adolf Hitler's National Socialist German Workers' Party, commonly known as the Nazi Party, gained traction in the wake of economic hardships and disillusionment with the Weimar Republic. The end of the Weimar Republic. The political polarization and violence culminated in the collapse of the Weimar Republic. In 1933, President Paul von Hindenburg appointed Hitler as Chancellor, solidifying the end of democratic rule. Conclusion From fragility to catastrophe, Germany's post-World War I years were marked by a turbulent quest for stability and prosperity. The Weimar Republic's attempts to navigate economic challenges, political extremism, and social transformation ultimately proved insufficient. The nation's slide into extremism and authoritarianism would have devastating consequences, leading to the catastrophe of World War II. Germany's interwar period stands as a cautionary tale about the fragile nature of democracy in times of crisis and the perils of political extremism.